I offer these every week, along with a short teaching. Just click the subscribe link below to be notified through YouTube when I post the recording of the latest one. Or if you'd like to join me live, which I'd really welcome, go down into the description section below and follow the link along to be able to sign up for free. So find a posture that is comfortable and alert. Probably with a sense of uprightness. I think about the title of Sokni Rinpoche's book, Carefree Dignity. The two together, a kind of openness, in Zen, it is said, soft in the front, firm in the back, carefree in the front, dignified in the back, um, just grounded, finding your place, settling in. Taking some breaths and letting your body settle. Commit to staying present. Establish the intention of mindfulness. Intending to let go of distractions and trains of thought that pull you away from the present. See what it's like to commit to staying present. Let your attention rove through your body in a natural way. Being aware of different sensations throughout your body. Feel your breath flowing into your chest and flowing out of your chest.
your chest rising and falling, sensations also in your abdomen and your shoulders as you breathe. While staying aware of your body, letting your attention, your awareness be wide and open, spacious. Letting your body calm, become more and more relaxed and tranquil. You're allowing thoughts to arise, images, emotions, it's all fine. You're simply staying present and aware while different thoughts and feelings pass through awareness. In effect, you're disengaging from experiences passing through awareness. You're not following after them. You're not getting carried along by them. You're being a kind of space or you're being a kind of being through which experiences pass while staying present and mindful.
aware and letting go. The simple, essential practice of meditating. Aware and letting go. Or aware and not holding on. While being aware and letting go, you may find a natural heartfeltness, a natural open-heartedness in all this. A kind of sweetness. The ancient word is sukha, a kind of heartfelt sweetness, present as you remain aware and letting go.
Resting in the sense of open-hearted presence. Let yourself rest here. Let the sense of open-hearted presence, perhaps with a sweetness, a happiness woven into it, let it be your object of meditation as you increasingly become absorbed in a sweet, open-hearted stability of presence.
if your mind wanders, bringing it back. Letting yourself kind of sink into a sense of being steadily present, aware, your heart open, perhaps with a kind of sweetness, a contentment mingling with this. And taking this experience as your object of meditation, becoming absorbed in it, establishing yourself in open-hearted presence, and letting those qualities become established in you. Letting yourself become naturally more present, open-hearted, and content as we meditate together. You might have a sense of a kind of warmth spreading inside you, an easing, a softening. An opening, a spreading.
giving over to this way of being, letting it have you, open, warm, content, at ease. In the last couple minutes of this meditation, if you like, you can do a little experiment in which you're centered in the meditative state, the feeling of openness, warm-heartedness, and contentment, while lightly imagining some of your activities regular activities, and get a sense of yourself engaging in them, including with other people, while feeling much of what you are right now, centered, present, all right, open, warm-hearted, content. Imagining being this way in some of your everyday activities. (laughs) 